A fire emergency in the remote and unforgiving waters of the Southern Ocean. The Australian Antarctic Division's resupply ship NPV Everest was five days into its journey back to Hobart when a fire broke out in the engine room in 2021, destroying two watercraft and causing significant damage to the area. Whilst there were no reported injuries or pollution as a result of the fire, it did leave the ship and its 109 personnel in a precarious situation, more than 1,700 nautical miles from Fremantle. An investigation by the Australian Transport and Safety Bureau found technical faults, inappropriate watchkeeping practices, crew fatigue and the design of the ship itself all contributed to fuel oil overflowing into the engine room, later igniting. Fires can get to such a stage that not only uh, are they burning flammable materials, they're starting to impact on the, the structural integrity of a vessel as well. The Bureau also found while there were regular fire drills on board the ship, they didn't include the engine room. Uh, when people don't feel confident to report things, raise things, and there's a lack of transparency around uh, risk assessments and things like that, uh, that's when you have dangerous things occur. The vessel made it to Fremantle without further incident eight days later, but the report highlights what could have happened if the crew on board was forced to abandon ship. In this case, it looked like a fishing trawler somewhere near Heard Island was likely to be the closest one to respond, but that still was a number of days sailing away. The Australian Antarctic Division says it's accepted all of the findings. It conducted an independent review of its pre-chartering processes, which resulted in a number of changes, such as ensuring the current safety management systems are fit for purpose and reviewing key personnel and experience. Liz Gwynn, ABC News.